Welcome back everybody. It's Christy with Anchor Life 5 and I'm coming at you today with a project share. I have just gotten into making traveler's notebooks and I am so excited. Um, I'm really proud of myself. I watched a couple of y'all's videos and I was really, really inspired to do this. Um, and I think they turned out pretty well. These are my first two ones that I made. So I'm just going to do a quick walkthrough with y'all and show you kind of what I did. So here's the first one. Um, these beads were actually in my Michaels grab bags that I got. And so I thought they were cute and kind of added a little nice touch to the elastic. I made this cute little clothespin um, with this little bow and it kind of matches. I kind of did like a vintage -y theme for both of these. Um, what I did, all this paper came in a kit and I, I don't remember what the kit was. I got it at Tuesday morning and um, I just kind of layered it and laminated it um, to give it some depth. Let me take that off. So here we go. On the inside, I laminated another um, little piece of paper and put some more die cuts and some washi tape right here to accent it. Um, another little paper clip that I made. And I just put some extra little pieces of paper in here and a little tag. Um, these are the folders. Once again, I've made um, this little paper clip right here with a sticker from the Dollar Tree and a paper clip from the Dollar Tree. So this is the f one of the folders. And I just used different color, like um, vintage looking cardstock. And then this is another one. Believe, Inspiration, Create, Dream, Destiny, Unforgettable, Sweet. And put some washi tape around it. And then this is a little folder that I made inside of here. This was just two little sheets of paper that came with the kit and I bound them together with some washi tape and laminated it so somebody could put something cute in there. And this key I got in my Michael's grab bag and what I did was I attached it to the bottom right here through one of the holes and you could bring it up through and use it kind of as a bookmark. And the last folder says Wonder and Discover. With some little washi tape right here. And just some more of that really cool vintage cardstock. And on the back, I did another little pocket held together with some, some gold washi. And then this one I made last night. Um, once again, all this paper came from a pack that I got it Tuesday morning. Um, I made this cute little clothespin with these really cute little flowers that kind of went with it and I got these with my Michaels grab bag and this one um, kind of a vintagey theme again with with some accents of gold throughout I made this cute little pocket right here held down with some washi tape from the Dollar Tree um, the little folders that I made I kind of used some more paper from this pocket and kind of accented this one. Um, had this cute little little tag folder right here and just put some extra little pieces of, of paper that came with the pack and put it down with the washi. Um, I actually found lined paper this time and so I thought that would be cool to add in a cute little paper clip that I made with a little sticker. And this is the second folder short and sweet. Once again, just some washi tape to accent. And then I made this little bookmark to go in it. Um, I just took a strip of paper that was actually the same as the front cover. Kind of tried to make it match and blend in a little bit. Put some washi tape, some cute little sayings, um, this really pretty ribbon right here and a little key that kind of matches the front of it also. So we got that little bookmark in there. And then the last folder, again with some line paper. And then there's the back. Home is where the heart is and all things grow better with love. So there you go guys. These are my two little traveler's notebooks that I just learned how to make and I'm so super excited and they are so much fun to make and to decorate. Um, 
and I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Go ahead and leave me a comment if you can, you know, find anything that you can suggest that I could could do better or a different way of of doing these notebooks. I would really, really appreciate the tips. Um, give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Anchor Live Five, and I will see y'all really soon. Thanks, guys. Bye.